Following our free educational materials, you learn English in a great way with ease and efficiency. What a lovely tapestry. Don't you think we could use one to decorate our room? I think we can have a try. Artistic tapestry is the highest form of expression of the rug weaving art, an exquisite handicraft of superb artistry in typical Chinese style. I see. Is this the marvelous landscape in Gilling? I think it is. Which do you prefer? The linen one, the figured dacron or the brocade? I prefer the linen one. Could you send up a Coke and a salad? Yes. Which kind of salad dressing would you prefer? Make them with French dressing. I'll do that then. A cup of coffee sounds good, doesn't it? Yes, but I think I'll have orange juice first. Do you feel like having anything to eat? Well, I think I'll try the pancakes. How about you? Sounds great. That's just what I feel like having. Okay, I'm ready for my driving lesson. Should I start the car? Hold on there, Fittipaldi. First let's go over things one more time. Now before you even think of starting the car, Make sure your seat is at a comfortable position and you can grip the steering wheel firmly. Next check your rear view mirrors to make sure you can see properly. We have been through this a million times. Let's get going already. I'm ready. Fine. Start the car. Now gently step on the clutch and shift to first gear. Good. Now accelerate gently and let go of the clutch as you do it. There we go. Good. I'm doing it. I'm driving. This is awesome. Let's turn some music on. Keep your eyes on the road. No music. We are coming up to a red light. Step on the brakes. What are you doing? I said the brakes. Look out for those people. Get off the sidewalk. Get out of my way. This is just like playing video games. It's the police. Pull over. They'll never take me alive. What can I do for you? I am looking for a pair of trousers. Do you have any good ideas? What about jeans? It's the fashion now. I don't like it. Actually, I am looking slacks. Then. How about this? It seems all right. Do you have pantaloons? Excuse me, I have something to trouble you. Yes, I'll be very glad if I could be of any help to you. An hour ago, I bought this vase with my tourist. Oh, yes, I remember it clearly. Is there anything wrong with it? I'm afraid so. We found this crack on the bottom when I went back to my hotel. Oh, how awful. Let me have a look. I'm terribly sorry. It was most thoughtless of me. Would you excuse me, please? Oh, it's quite all right, I suppose. It can't be helped sometimes. It's very kind of you to say so. How about changing another one for you? All right, thank you. Just a minute, please. I won't be long. I'm sure this one is perfect. You may examine it carefully. Oh, yes, it is. I'll take this one. I'm very sorry for any inconvenience I've caused you. Well, there's no reason to apologize for such a trifle thing. How are you? No so good. 
I broke traffic regulations yesterday and I got a ticket. Could you tell me how you dealt with it this time? Certainly, as long as you don't tell my wife. Your dog is so much fun. He's so playful. I wish our cat enjoyed being around people as much as your dog does. Cats are well known for being more independent than dogs. How old is your cat now? You've had her longer than we've had our dog. She's eight years old. She's getting quite old. Your dog's six, isn't he? Yes. He's so energetic. We take him out to the park every morning and evening. I think he'd be happy to stay there all day. I'm sure he would. We usually have to drag him home. Your cat spends most of the day outdoors, right? Do you kino where she goes? She spends less time outdoors and she used to. We have no idea where she goes. She's very secretive. Occasionally, she brings back a dead mouse. Have you ever thought about having another pet? The kids want a rabbit. I don't think it would be a good idea to get a mouse or a fish. That might be too tempting for our cat. Waitress. Yes, sir. How can I help you? Please clean up the table. Okay. And anything else I can do for you? I like a refill, please. Sure. Miss, may I help you? Yes, I just wondered why the price between the ninth and tenth floor is so different. It's because of the view. Oh, I see. Can you show me the location of Block I? Sure. Please take a look at the model of the building. Nice Garden has a total of two blocks which are labeled Block I and Block II. Block I has a total of 38 floors. The 37th and 38th are penthouses. There are four units in one floor. The sizes of the units are 1,000 square feet and 1,500 square feet. The size with 1,000 square feet has three bedrooms and the biggest size has four bedrooms. How many elevators are there? There are three elevators between 148 units. How about the car park space? There are a total of 160 parking spaces on the second and third floor, in which 12 are for visitors and the rest are for residents. Any other facilities? Sure. On the fourth floor is a recreation quarter. There are two swimming pools. One is Olympic standard size and the other one is for children. Also, there is a gymnasium for resident members only. What is the completion date? The completion date will be July 1, 2007. How about the price and the bank mortgage? Please check up the price list. The average unit price is 5 million Hong Kong dollars. There are eight different banks that will provide a 70% mortgage loan. Also, the developer will offer another 10% mortgage to purchasers. How many payment methods are there? It's all written on the brochure price list. I believe there will be one right for you. Please hurry up because almost half of units have already gone. Thank you. I think I have to talk to the bank representatives. Thank you for your help. You're welcome. Our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English.